today's topic is direct and indirect speech today we are going to discuss how we report a reported speech or how do we write a direct speech direct speech is the direct conversation or convey of message in inverted commas wherein we do not change the wordings or what a actually the person has said to us but in a reported speech we remove the inverted commas that is we do not express the same thing but we add on some changes to it for example i'll give you like in direct speech we can say naresh no the school shall remain closed on monday now i have put this in a direct speech form wherein we've put inverted commas this can be reported in a speech by removing the remote, uh, the inverted commas that can be written as naresh said that or naresh told me that the school will remain closed on monday so this is the basic difference between a direct and an indirect speech this is a speech given directly by the person itself and this is a quoted speech removing the inverted commas now let us understand how, what all speeches get converted into reported speech this is the change in verb forms simple present tense see before explaining all the rules let me make it very clear that all the tenses or all the verb forms get converted into a past tense in reported speech we remove the inverted commas and we convert all the direct speeches to reported speeches in past tense moving on simple present simple present will get converted into simple past present continues past continues present perfect past perfect present perfect continuous tense past perfect continuous tense simple past now in this case simple past will get converted into past perfect again past continuous will get converted to past perfect continuous tense and past perfect and past perfect continuous tense they remain unchanged so if you find a direct speech in past perfect and past perfect continuous uh, tense it remains entirely unchanged for the reported speech moving on to the simple future now this is a tricky thing because converting a future tense back to a past tense in a reported speech will be difficult but to make it easier we'll understand the rules first and then look on to the examples simple future will get converted into past again but shall or will will be converted to would future continues again past shall be will be converted to would be future perfect again past perfect future perfect continues past perfect continues but shall have will have will get converted to would have shall have been or will have been will get converted to would have been 
now we have certain set of words that get converted from direct speech to reported speech in ways like can gets converted to could from direct speech to reported speech can gets converted to could may might might should ought to this remains unchanged most of the times why because it is already in a reported form or they are either in their past form 